At siyempre, nagbabalik po ang pambansang almusal sa ating usapang business. Kasama pa rin natin ngayong umaga, walang iba, kundi si Sir Ace David, ang Chief Strategist ng DCP Managers Incorporated. Good, good morning. morning, Sir Ace. Good morning, good morning. Araw-araw <laughs> ha, ibang aura mo. Ganun ba? Oo. Pero Sir Ace, <laughs> basan pa tayo makarating? Baka na naman tayo dito. <laughs> basan pa tayo makarating, Sir Ace? What's in store for us? Ano bang isishare niyo sa amin ngayong umaga na magiging gabay po ng uh, ating mga manunood, lalo na yung mga kapambansang almusal natin na gusto magnegosyo? As, as a preview to uh, um, to our discussion sa Acer in a short while, no? mm -hmm. gusto ko lang i-discuss yung smart objective. Okay. This is very useful to everyone, especially yung mga nagne-negosyo, mm -hmm. even in our career, no? in uh -huh. our personal career enhancement. Mm -hmm. So, yung, ano ba tong smart objective? S for specific, uh -huh. M for measurable, mm -hmm. A for attainable, R for realistic, and T for time-bound. Bakit kailangan po yung smart objective yeah. na yan? The question of bakit kailangan, simply because, importante na, yun nga, yung plano mo, mm. yung objective mo sa buhay, specific, Ay, ano ba mm. talaga? Okay. Measurable, eto ba e kaya mo? Kaya oh, oh. ma, 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 May sukatan ba? Oh, para malaman mo kung ma evaluate mo mm -hmm. based dun sa sukatan. Attainable. Pwede ba siyang ma-achieve ma mo ba mm -hmm. siya? Magkaiba kasi yung pangarap at saka magkaiba yung plano. Mm -hmm. Okay? Most of the time, mas magandang pinaplano kesa pinapangarap. Ayun. Kaya tinatawag natin ang objective is attainable. Mm -hmm. In lieu of that, dapat kung attainable yan, at the same time, realistic. Oo oh, nga naman. ba? Diba? Mahirap naman na <laughs> madaling Gusto mangarap. Gusto ko magtayo ng isang negosyo na uh, ang business ay mga pagawaan ng ginto. Eh, sa aking kalagayan mm -hmm. sa buhay, parang hindi naman po pwede yata oh, mayroon. Pangarap lang yun. yun. Ano? Kaya, kaya kailangan yung objective mo maging realistic. Ayun. O, maging alahero ka muna, mm -hmm. perhaps. No? O kaya maglinis ka muna ng mga ginto. Correct. Higit sa lahat, yung pinakahuli is time-bound. What do you mean ano by time-bound? Ano sabihin ng time-bound? Dapat merong specific na time. Dapat ma-achieve ko to in the next 10 years. Uh -huh. Yan. Speaking of 10 years, Pag-usapan natin dito sa aking pinrepair na interview mm -hmm. with Ms. Agnes Espino, the Director of Sales and Marketing of Acer Philippines, on what they have accomplished in the last 10 years. Oh, eh, kasi isang dekada na nga isang po sila. Isang dekada ano? na sila. Mm -hmm. Ito po. Education, passion, skills. These are just some of the elements that make a company excel and eventually be number one in their field. Good day, dear viewers. Some claim they are the kings in the IT industry, but this company simply is the ace among the kings. Let us meet the number one in the IT industry in the Philippines here at IT Time with Ace. On this episode, I am indeed privileged to be with Ms. Agnes Espino, the Director of Sales and Marketing of Acer Philippines. Ang gusto kong unang itanong sa kanya, Kung paano na-sustain ng Acer yung 10 years nila na number one brand. Agnes, maybe let's start our discussion to to have the understanding of bakit ang Acer for the last 10 years is eh, still a preferred and I understand a number one brand pa on some categories. Okay. Um, thank you for asking that, Nice. Mm -hmm. uh, for the past 10 years, uh, this is our 10th year by the way, so uh, we're celebrating our anniversary and you're right. Uh, we've sustained being the number one brand in both um, uh, notebooks, maybe mm -hmm. about 30 plus percent um, uh, per IDC's uh, Q3 2013. 33 percent? Uh, a third? A third yes, of the about, business? Yes. Right. Okay. Um, so, um, aside from that, uh, we also have about 40 percent market share in projectors. Dominance? Uh, yes, that's true. Wow. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, Ano yung sikreto nito? Bakit ba nagkakaroon ang Acer ng certain market dominance on certain brand category? Ano ba ang mga, mga pinapatupad ninyo? What are you implementing within your organization? Um, una, sa produkto, no? uh, the products that we bring in are uh, usually first to market. We usually are the first to market, so the products we seek to bring in um, are the most innovative uh, uh, in terms of uh, 
form factor in terms of technology. Okay. We would have the latest ones uh, in the market. Mm -hmm. And then uh, the price would be competitive. Uh, so we give them value for money. Um, we, we distribute them through a very good channel. Our partners have been very supportive, okay. uh, both in the retail front and in the commercial front. So, um, and of course, the people inside. So if you, if you notice um, uh, here in Acer, no, uh, each person uh, has a specific job function and they're very passionate about it, okay. which they are able to um, um, share with the channel partners. And mm -hmm. of course, even the store people, they, when they discuss the products, they're just as passionate. So uh, with that, we're able to push through uh, or push our products uh, all the way through. Actually, uh, mm -hmm. I, I will share you an experience. Uh, I was once upon a time in one of their concept stores. Oh, really? I felt so at home. Mm -hmm. Now, it's, it's, it's really a, uh, an aspect of you hold the product yourself, then these people who are assisting me, as if we really know each other. True, true. Uh, mm -hmm. I think that's one of the key factor of, uh, of uh, relationship. With, with your clientele. I think uh, this is a very good foundation with Acer. And having said that, um, in the next coming years, perhaps for another, in the next 10 years, what are the what are we expecting as consumers? No? What are we looking forward to? What are the additional plans and strategies that Acer would have in place? All right. Um, every year we have a planning period. Right now is a planning period actually. We are we're able, we look at more than just a year. We look strategically into the years to come. And in, in all the planning, uh, in our planning process, we always take into consideration what is it that the market wants. We're not talking about a specific market. We're talking about several markets. You see, yeah, you see, um, it evolves. So. Um, now that the, uh, the, the PCs have become um, more commercial or commoditized, mm -hmm. uh, we have now many different types of consumers. Mm -hmm. uh, some may just want the unit for gaming purposes. Some really use it for professional, for their work. Mm -hmm. um, others may use it for, um, aside from games, uh, some people probably would use it to do uh, um, uh, uh, mixed, mixed right. uh, uh, usage. usage yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. So, yun yung uh, product development side nyo, no? yeah. So you are tailor, tailor fitting it based on certain market segment. That's true. Right. So that's the reason why there are quite a number of categories, ano? Even mm -hmm. on cell phones, ha? Mm -hmm. Napansin ko na yung mga cell phone nyo nowadays are already a mobile computing. That's true. Right. I think it's ready to take off na to be head on with. Uh, certain brands that I think I don't like to mention anyway but uh, it seems that it's very competitive huh? It is very competitive. Yeah, interesting enough, um, the we uh, PC has evolved. You know, many times I hear that oh no, PC is go going well. It's going. It's really going well out of uh, out of the market today. And I would always say that um, PC is not is not dying. It is right. actually evolving. Mm -hmm. So the regular PC, whether it be notebooks and da desktops, desktops, they've actually evolved to something else. Some are hybrids. You see. Uh -huh. um, some have become some some un, some form factors are tablets. Some may be um, converted converted into different types of form factors. Uh, they can be a notebook. They can be a tablet. They can be a desktop. Mm -hmm. So you will see a lot more of these exciting products in the years to come. So. Uh, um, Gone were the days when you just see a desktop as something you put in the, uh, on your table. Right. Mm -hmm. uh, or now you can see uh, the all-in-ones, the touch screen. Right. The technology has made all uh, these exciting things possible. Yeah. Let, let's take this opportunity that you talk to our consumers uh, to invite them and patronize uh, your Acer product lines. Acer Philippines would like to invite you all to uh, come and uh, try and buy the products at their concept stores and other multi-brand stores in the malls and in the standalones. To our dear IT time with Acer televiewers, you have just heard the quality, the services, the passion of exploring beyond limits. Good morning. Yun pala sir, is hindi ganun kadali ano, para ma-maintain mo yung pagiging top one yes. sa loob ng sampung taon. Right. Ano? Actually, yun yung sinasabi ko kanina na 
smart objective. Mm -hmm. Kasi nga, uh, ano siya, specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, and mm -hmm. time-bound. Pagka sinabi mo, I'd like to be a number one brand or a preferred brand in the mm -hmm. next 10 years. Mm -hmm. So, ang trabaho mo in the next 10 years, eh, abutin yun. Yun, yun yung pagiging time-bound. At being uh, no, director ng sales and marketing, hindi basta-basta rin trabaho oh, yes. yung Sir Ace. Naka, uh, nasa balikat niya yung uh, talagang <laughs> no. direksyon ng kanilang mm -hmm. kumpanya. Siguro minsan pwede rin siyang magbigay ng ano dito no, sa atin. Sa... May imbitahan natin yan. Sooner or later, uh, makakasama natin yan on the third seat perhaps. Ayan, <laughs> third seat. Ayan, Sir Ace, would you like to add more po kung meron kayong gusto sabihin Yun ka? lang, no, sa ating mga kapambansang almusal, ang gusto lang nating i-impart, lalo na sa ating mga nanonood, mga estudyante, mm -hmm. even doon sa mga career person, set your smart objective. Specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, and time-bound. Ayan. Thank you, thank you so much, you Sir too, Ace David, mm -hmm, ang Chief Strategist po ng DCP Managers Incorporated. At makakasama pa rin naman natin si Sir Ace sa mga susunod pang mga araw. Ayan. At dito po sa Usapang Business, lagi ko nga po sinasabi sa inyo, sama-sama po tayong matuto, magnegosyo, umunlad. At magbabalik pa ang inyong pinaka-paborito morning show, Pambansang Almusal!